Previously on The Walking Dead. Whatever this thing is between us, I want to give it a chance. And I know the fact that David is back in our lives now makes this whole thing a little more complicated. But do you feel the same way? I'm in. All the way. Oh my god, really? Really. Just look what he's done. I had a very interesting conversation with your friend Eleanor last night. Isn't that right, Eleanor? That's... that's right. You've put me in a no-win situation here. Both of them deserve to die for their crimes. However, Javi, I'll let you spare one of them. Just one. Trip has to live. Shoot him. Wait! I said Trip should live! No! How about you take David and the rest of your people and just get the hell out? We're leaving. All of us. Right now. It's Kate. She's coming for us. Oh, shit. Oh, God. While we're still breathing, Javi, I'm letting the bones speak to me. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I think I can hear them. They're saying, You're gonna lose, come mierda, so play already. I must have inherited patience from Ma. Oh, come on, man. Calm down, David. No one is ever in a rush to lose. Victoria. Carajo. I was so close. You're now my least favorite son, Javier. Hey, he's the one who beat you. Fine, it's a tie. I hate you both equally. Kicked out of baseball. Can't play dominoes. What exactly are you good at again, Javi? At least I can actually play baseball. Slugger. That's enough, both of you. It's not Javi's fault he's a disgrace to the game of dominoes. I won. That's ten bucks you owe me. Both of you. I know you're broke, Javi. You should sit out the next game, since we all know I'm gonna win. No shame in surrender. You'd all understand. Good game, David. Nicely played. Nice or not, a win is a win. Pay up, little brother. If you can. I'll cover for Javier. Oh, is it your turn to do that now? I lost track. Poor, helpless Javi. Get my wallet, mijo. Keep an eye on him. You don't want him snatching an extra 20 for gas money. It's on the counter. Yeah, sure, Pa. Pa? What's this? Hey, man, I was reading that. What? Wh what's up? What the fuck is this? None of your business. He has cancer. What? Bob, really? I'm old. Old people get cancer. You didn't need to know. That's not for you to decide. Oh my God. You really should have told us. It's the right thing to do. It's my cancer. I get to do whatever I want. You know now. What difference does it make? How? Bad. It's okay, mijo. Ask me. How bad is it? 
You won't have to worry about paying me back that ten bucks. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, Pa. Hey, settle, David. Now. You haven't told Mama. And neither will either of you. You hear me? Mouth shut. That's not okay, Pa. You have to tell her. Uh, when the time is right, I, I will. That's not good enough. It's good enough for me. You're gonna need her help with this, Pa. Driving you to the doctor, getting prescriptions. Wait, what are your options? Treatment, stuff like that. Chemo, radiation, all that expensive mierda. Great. When do you start? I turned it down. Turned it down? You don't get to turn it down. So much money and for what? Another month. Another game of dominoes to lose. It's not worth it. If I was still playing ball, I could have paid for it. I'll pay for it. It's not happening. Save your money. Fuck the money. I can afford it. You can afford it, David. But my pride can't. Let's play another game. You are a fucking coward. A selfish coward. Javi, can you believe this shit? David, I get it, man. It's not fair, but come on, take it easy. Sit down. Both of you. You know, I pray for daughters. <laughs> Every night your mother was pregnant with both of you. Please, God, a daughter. Anything but a son. Anything but another me. Anything but another hot-headed idiot with his heart in the right place. Anything but another foolhardy, handsome gambler. Anything at all. Please, Papa. Don't give up. Fight. Fight for our name. For our blood. For our family. Please, fight. It's your life, Pa. Live it however you want, or as long as you want. You're both the same, only thinking about yourselves. <sighs> Don't worry, Pa. He'll come around. You should have supported him. Wait, what? I'm on your side. Still, I'm gonna be a name carved in stone before you know it, Javier. That'll be me. Letters on a rock that nobody wants to visit. I know you think you're strong enough to handle that alone. And so does your brother. And you're both wrong. You have to take care of each other. You two are all I'll leave behind. Like Gabe and Mariana will be for David. Legacy, Javier. It's all anyone leaves behind. That and their bones. Be brothers before it's too late. That's not too much to ask. One last favor for your old man. Okay, Pa, I'll try. As hard as you can? As... as hard as I can. I still need to pay, David. Pa. Oi, if you had just won the game, we wouldn't have had this problem. <laughs> So you're blaming me for all this. I'm depending on you, mijo. We both are.
Something's happened to her. If you've gotten her, you better hope she's alive. Shut up for once and help me find her. What do you think I'm doing? Kate! 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 David, wait! What's the matter with you two? Focus on your surroundings. Uh, There's Gabe and Clem. Lead the way, Javi. Get the knee, like this. Oh, nice. I got a great teacher. You guys all right? Yeah. I'm fine. Look at them! There's so many! We'll be safer inside. Get in! That should hold them for now. You put up a good fight out there. I don't care what you think. Gabriel, do not take that tone with me. You murdered that man after they let you go. You're a killer, just like they said. You did that? You don't understand. It was them or us. I had to do it. They would never let us go. They still would have killed us, sooner or later. They were negotiating with us, David. Doing that to Clint wasn't necessary. That's how you see it. I would do it again. His brains splattered all over me. You are my son. I am doing what any parent would do to keep you safe. You do not get to judge my actions. Do you hear me? Hey, you do not walk away from me. When someone speaks to you, you stand up and answer them. David, that's enough. He's not a little boy. He doesn't need that from you. What he needs is to learn to keep his opinions to himself until he understands what the hell he's talking about. I'm just... I'm trying to protect you, Gabe. I lost you once. I won't let it happen again. Okay? We made it through alive. Let's just be glad about that. We need to check the other entrances. Make sure we're safe. Gabe, want to help me out? Javi? Gabriel! Just be careful, buddy. A lot of muertos out there. Gabe and I will watch each other's backs. I'll help, too. O okay. Hey. Clem's with them. It's fine. It's not that. It's... Let's just... <sighs> I'm all over the place. I need to focus on something. Anything. Just need to focus. On whatever. Let's see if there are any other survivors. It'd be good to know who's still around. I don't want to think about how many people may have just died. <sighs> but I guess I'm gonna have to find out eventually. Let's go.
Oh my god. This is a fucking nightmare. Mommy, it's them. I'm glad Mariana didn't live to see this. To see what her father's become. To see what I've done. She'd be just like that little boy. Scared that the monsters are coming after her next. She would never trust us again. And I wouldn't blame her. Kate, come on. We're not monsters. I don't know who we are anymore. But it's not the people she knew. I did this to them. But that hole is there because of me. This is all my fault. What happened was an accident. A bad one, but still. You didn't do it on purpose. But it's still my fault. I can't leave until I make this right. All of this. Let's fix this. As best we can. All right, Kate. Let's make things right. I don't know if it's actually possible. But I feel a lot better knowing you're there, too. Trip was my best friend, Javi. He died because of you. He didn't deserve this. You have no one to blame but yourself. Your actions betrayed Trip. And to think of how much he cared about you. I never thought it would be like this. You have to believe that. God, what do I tell Conrad? The woman he loved, his friend, his home. All gone in days. What's done is done. I don't have to like it. But I can't change it. But you, you've got a lot of nerve showing up here. After the bullshit you pulled, you're unbelievable. Oh, oh, I've got a lot of nerve. Everything that happened is because of you. This is all your fault. I told you, I didn't want to leave. You didn't listen. Joan did. Why did you tell Joan what we were doing? I was triaging a bad situation. Their doctor is barely functioning. And before you guys fucked it all up, their walls worked. It's not only about me. I can actually save lives here. Not just stitch them up and hope for the best. These people will die without me, Javi. I know she, well, fucked us over, but she's trying to help them. She's trying to make something right. That's worth forgiving, right? She's trying, that counts. She's doing a good thing now, but she's got a long way to go before I forgive her. <laughs> You're one to talk. We should try to help. Not everyone here is guilty. Burn. Is that you, darling? I'm here, handsome. Vernon Rufus. What's wrong with him? Bitten. He's slipping in and out of delirium. We have to find Ida. We have to find our daughter. I know that guy. We had a situation. He's lucky I didn't shoot him. Looks like his luck just ran out. Let them have a minute. It's the least we can do. Y'all get over here. You gotta cut his arm off. It's too far along. I'm sorry. Bullshit. It can work. I've seen it. Do you want his last moments alive to be more painful than they need to be? I just want to try. I can't lose everyone. Please. I'm begging you. No way. I'm not a doctor. They're the only ones who should do that. I already said no. He's gonna fucking die!
Fern. You need to put him down when he turns. That's an order. I want to help you. Okay. Well... What the... We're all fucking dead because of you! Hey, easy. You We're... blew a hole in our wall! Got my little girl killed! Got my whole fucking family killed! Richmond was fine until your stupid easy ass for... showed up. We're dead fucking meat, David. Might as well take out this asshole while I can. Fern. Shut up! You're wrong. This wasn't my fault. But it was my baby! Stand down. That's an order. Kate, no! Fern, this is all because of me. I caused the explosion. I killed your daughter. Please, forgive me. It's my fault. Please. Please, from a mother to a mother. David! Oh my god! Dad! You're welcome, Javi. That dead guy! David! What are you doing? This isn't right! David! Oh my god! This is unacceptable! Okay? Don't thank me. No! David! Dave! I, I, I'm sorry, that was an accident. You were going to kill her! She was going for her gun! Look at her! Gabe, I'm... She can't even stand up! What the hell is wrong with you? Gabe... I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to do that to you. You know that. Why the hell are you all looking at me that way? They're just... They're scared, David. Of what? I'm protecting and them! Why are you pointing a gun at us? So I'm all alone. Fine, then. You people are on your own. I've seen that look in his eyes before. You should go after him. David? What are you doing? Come over here. Or are you afraid of me too? I know the rest of them are. Right? Even if they are, I'm not. I've dealt with scarier than you, brother. There's no if, Javi. They are. My wife, Javi. My son. They look at me differently. Maybe you're seeing them differently. I want to show you something. Stand with me. Uh, why the hell are you smiling? See that sewer line over there? Perfect placement for a trench. That hill about a hundred paces west of it. A sniper's wildest dream come true. I'm a soldier, Javi. I see this landscape like a painter sees a blank canvas. Like how you used to see a baseball diamond. I'm a soldier. This makes sense to me. I was made for this. I thrive in this. 
Baseball was a lifetime ago. I miss it so fucking much. When I wasn't deployed, I'd miss being out in the field. Now that's all I am. Every day. A soldier isn't a husband. Or a father. A soldier is a soldier. Nothing else. Nothing. Nothing at all. Call yourself whatever you want. I still see you as my brother. That is kind of you to say, Javi. I wish... I wish I had your heart sometimes. I want to change, Javi. I always have. Really? All you ever tried to do was get me to change. <sighs> Only because I couldn't bring myself to do it first. It's the one war I could never win. And I'm wondering why. Is it because I don't know how? Or because it's impossible to change who you really are? I don't know, man. Some things... Well, some things can't be moved no matter how hard we push. Maybe you're one of them. Maybe. I hope you're wrong, Javi. But like Pa always said, hope in one hand, shit in the other. See which fills up first. I did what you asked. You did. Thanks for that. So now, will you step back? <laughs> sure. I found them! They're up here! Be careful, Javi. I ran into... She was still outside when we checked on the entrances. There are muertos everywhere. We got her inside just in time. Seriously, I've never seen so many muertos. Oh, it's awful out there. That was the right thing to do. Proud of you, buddy. Ava! Uh, about earlier. I guess I owe you an explanation. About what happened on the stage with Joan and Tripp. You don't have to say anything to me. Your actions said plenty. I read you loud and clear. But go ahead and say whatever you want. Hey, don't get mad at me. It was a total no-win scenario. Just be glad the situation was what it was. And that she didn't make me pick between you and your brother. There's so many. They're pouring in. You don't know the half of it. The herd has taken over Richmond. The streets are filled with walkers. With that hole in the wall, this city is fucked. We're not safe here. No one is. Oh, Jesus Christ. What the fuck have we done? So what do we do? I don't want to die up here. None of us do, Gabe. Stabilize the city. Figure out how to make it safer for everyone. I saw construction vehicles when we got the armored truck. We can use those to stop the Muertos, seal the breach, and save Richmond. That's over by the motor pool at the water tower. We could use the highway overpass to get to the water tower. Come on. Let's jump. <sighs> Come on, it's an easy jump. <clears throat> Keep your eyes open, stay aware of your surroundings, all of you. Let's move out. When we found Kate earlier, she hugged you. Why do you think she hugged you? Why was that? Just wondering. You really want to know? Then ask her. She won't even make eye contact with me. Here, or else the exact same thing will happen to us. Stay sharp and do not fire your guns. We're gonna be fine. That guy was all alone. We're not. Yeah. 
Everyone hold back. Let Javi and I clear out these walkers. Good to go. Let's move. You okay, bud? I was little, Dad used to ask me what I wanted to be when I was a man. And I pointed him. He always liked that. I thought he was such a great guy. I would always make him smile. Yeah. Lots of kids hero worship like that. It's part of the job. Yeah. I guess it was. Be like your uncle. You told me that all the time. Don't be a man who relies on other people to solve your problems. Because then you're not a man at all. I used to think he was right. Not anymore, though, Javi. I can only hope I grow up to be like you. So, here's hoping. Oh, thanks, buddy. It means a lot. I'm sorry I never really said it before. I should have. Really, thanks a million. You're welcome, Amelia. You took such good care of me. Now we need to take care of Dad. He's the one that needs our help. We're gonna have to go around the side. There's barely any room. No time to waste. Come on. You know, I didn't think there was much that could scare me anymore. And yet, here we are. Just goes to show you. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Life is full of surprise. This isn't that bad. I believe in you guys. You can do this. Careful. I'm sorry, man. I know she was important to you. I would have died a long time ago without her. Thank you, Ava. Goodbye, my friend. We have to get across. I know Gabe doesn't see it, but David really is trying to look out for him. He's not doing the best job, but no one gives you a rule book to raise a kid. And they sure as shit don't. It's just one thing I don't get, though. Did David really think he was helping AJ by letting him go? Why did he stop guarding him? Maybe you should ask him that. It might be that he just didn't care. Not everyone's like you, Clem. Not everyone wants to take care of a baby. I guess not, but after you put in all that work, so much of your heart... AJ was a brat. He lived with me after we kicked you out, Clem. I'd already raised two kids. Thought it'd be a piece of cake. <laughs> not with that tyrant. Is that why you gave him away? We had a bad winter. Destroyed every crop we had. I couldn't leave Richmond, and A.J. couldn't stay in Richmond. I gave A.J. to Lingard and told him to do whatever he had to to save his life. I miss that Brett.
Never ask Lingard about it again. Though I wanted to. Well, sounds like it was your only option. You did the right thing. I hope so. I think about it. Every day. It wasn't easy, Clem. Remember, far as I knew, I'd already lost two children. It wasn't any easier with number three. It's never easy. I'm gonna keep you alive. Keep all of us alive. And hope that that's enough. Enough for atonement. He was your responsibility, no matter what. I thought it was best. You thought wrong. Yeah. Maybe I did. Holy shit. Chopped right in half. You're not thinking. It's that or go back. We should go lightest to heaviest. That way it won't break on the first swing. I'll go first, Clem. Get a long run up, but not too long. If you take too many quick steps, you'll propel yourself upward instead of out. David. He's got this. She's right. I do. <sighs> Come on, Clem. Your turn. for the kids to swing across, but us? You've got this. I've seen you do things that are way scarier. Okay. I can do it. <sighs> All right, David. You're up. You're the little brother. You should go first. Oh, you're definitely lighter. Aw, oh, come on, you know the drill. Age before beauty. <laughs> you fucker. Quite the little ride there. I definitely can't go back now. Glad you made it. Enough. Come on. Almost there. I miss when all we did was track the herd. 
from a safe distance? We need to get down there. We're not getting anywhere without one of those vehicles. It's not like we can just ask all those walkers to move out of the way. How about we make some noise and distract them? We could use that generator. That's a great idea, Gabe. When'd you get so smart, Gabe? You really aren't the same kid I remember. I'm impressed, really. Oh, what can I say? Taught him well. Oh my god, Javi, really? It's okay, Dad. He's right. We still gotta get to the generator somehow. Cut a walker open and cover yourself with its guts. Then you can slip right through them. What? Ugh. I mean, please tell me you're kidding. I said please. So, who's gonna do it? You know, you do kinda owe me one. You let Conrad use me as trade. That wasn't very polite. If it makes us even. Look, it smells really bad. Like, way worse than you think. <sighs> You did it, Javi. Barely. Now that we're here, we gotta find something to seal the breach with. All we need is the right vehicle. Oh, that's not gonna do the job, man. Yes, it is. What are you doing? The right thing. I'm leaving. 
We're all leaving. What? And going where? You saw it yourself. We're surrounded by the herd. I'm taking my family out of here. You helped keep them safe, Clem. You're coming too. Let's go. Everyone. We can't wait around. This is bullshit, David. Absolutely not. Everyone in Richmond will die without us. They don't matter, Poppy. Don't you get that? This all started the day we knocked on Richmond's door. We brought this on these people, all of us. We can't abandon them. Not after what we've done. We're going home, Kate. Back to the last place we were a family. We're starting over. We're all together again. Finally. It's time. All of us. A new day. A new life. But what about here, man? Make Richmond our new home. Richmond is gone, Javi. I'm not gonna let the people I love die trying to save a dead dream. I'll go with you, Dad. Gabe! He's my father, Clem. I'm sorry, but... you really wouldn't understand. Think this over, buddy. Gabe? Is this what you really want? I know it's scary out there, but... I have to. You don't have to be afraid, Gabe. I won't let what happened to Mariana happen to you. You have my word. I will protect you the right way. We always hoped you would come back. I wish you'd gotten to know her. Her smile, man, it was, it was like sunshine. I'm not missing another minute with my family now. This is what I want. I... I understand, Gabe. I'm still going back. I won't be able to live with myself if I don't try to help the people in Richmond. You won't be able to live at all if you do that. Richmond is compromised. Doesn't matter if there were five of us trying to save it or 500. We'd all die. I know a losing battle when I see one. We're moving out. Everybody get in. That's an order. How fucking dare you? What will it take, David? What will it take to show you that you do not get to do that? We are not your soldiers. Run away home. Be a deserter. I am done with you. Let's go, Javi. Why the fuck do you think he would go with you? Tell him. What the fuck is this? I love her, man. We're in love. I should have known. I should have known the night Pa died. The night you weren't there. Blood is worthless to you. Just like he was to you. Just like I am to you. Well, it's time for you to finally learn what blood really means. David! Dad! What do you have to say for yourself, brother? David! Stop it! Fuck you, David! Jesus Christ, stop! Bastard! You're not taking my family from me! David, you... <laughs> Fucking asshole! Fuck you! Guys, stop! That's enough! Both of you, stop! <laughs> Dad, no! Dave! Oh my god! David, no! I'm gonna fucking kill you!
Abe, it took him. We can't wait any longer. We have to go help Richmond. I'm getting on that bulldozer. But Gabe... Gabe wanted to go. He did. We all heard it. You're... You're right. I'm going to save Richmond. Someone has to. You're gonna need as much help as you can get, Kate. I'll go with you. Okay. Javi, you hop on that motorcycle and go after Gabe. What about you two? I can take care of myself. We're out of time. Javi, I'm sorry. I've been here before, more than once. It's not gonna end well for everyone. You have to decide. Hard to be caught in the middle. I know that. I'm not gonna risk either of you getting hurt. We save the city. Together. Let's go seal the breach. Then we go after Gabe? Then we go after Gabe. If we don't die first. If we're gonna drive into the herd, we're gonna need these. Scythe. Can you help us get the gate open? Almost didn't recognize you, Jesus. Once I got in contact with my people, I headed right back. Had to make sure you folks were safe. I think I'm getting the hang of this. We'll keep the muertos away. Just get me to the gate so I can open it up. I got your back, Javi. We're almost there. Javi, get in the bus kit and I'll lift you to the top of the gate. Musket? The thing in the front! The scooper thing! Whatever! Get in it! I'll keep them off you! Yuck! Javi! The busket! Right! Yeah, busket! I see you folks who drop by! Open gate button. You did it, Javi! Bingo. Let's get inside and wrangle the walkers together. If we get them in one group, we can lead them right out. Steam ahead. There's 
crossed. To, uh, well, not to this. It's just a little surprising. That's all. This? Huh, this is just another Tuesday in Richmond. We need to get it under control. Trouble in one place usually finds its way to another. Javi, we have to go after Gabe. These guys can take care of the rest of the walkers. Go, Javi. I'll help out here. Okay. Let's go, Clem. Javi, until they, <coughs> but I couldn't, there were so many, I fucked up, after everything you taught me, oh, it really hurts. You didn't fuck anything up, buddy, you fought as hard as you could, I'm proud of you. I, I tried, I really did. I know. Do me a favor, go on. Gabe, no. Take my cards. What? My playing cards. Grab them. TJJ Euchre. Okay? Okay. Give me your gun, Javi. <coughs> I don't want it turn into a muerto. Gabe. Gabe, I don't know if I can let you do that to yourself. And I can't make you guys do it for me. Just give me the gun. Hurry. Javi. You, you have to hurry.
I'm glad you helped me, Javi. But I can't stop wondering how things might be different if you hadn't. Maybe Gabe wouldn't be with Mariana right now. They deserve better, Javi. Better than us. Gabe. Mariana. They were my responsibility. They're dead because of me. We're all to blame. Not just you. Usually the quiet scares me. What about now? There's a lot of work to be done. The herd could come back. Still, though, I feel more calm here than... than I ever did in an old van on streets with no streetlights. We earned this, Javi. We earned feeling calm in the quiet. Let's start a family. You and me. A fresh start. What do you say? I think it'd be good for us. You're on. Let's start a family. You don't think it's selfish? It's not the safest world outside of Richmond. Or inside it, truth be told. So long as I got you, I'm not too worried about it. <sighs> we'll be up there before we know it. Better do something worthwhile in the meantime. And yet death was not something you could ignore. It had its weight. It seemed to her she had better not form the practice of ignoring death. If she tried it, death would find a way to answer back. It would take another of her loved ones to remind her to respect it. What's that you're reading? Oh, some old book Francine always tried to get me to read. Cowboys and shit like that. Told her it wasn't my style. She would insist, though. <laughs> and I'd insist right back otherwise. Francine must have had good taste. Looks like you're enjoying it. Just don't tell Francine. Heading out? Yes, indeed. We came here to put an end to the raiding. Looks like that's been done. Glad we got it settled. Gotta move on. I gotta admit, man, you're a fucking badass. You're a real charmer. You know that, through and through. Meant to tell you, that uh, armor you got is great. Oh. Oh, uh. Hmm. Well, uh, thanks. Uh, it gets the job done. I don't meet a lot of people like you, Javi. Someone genuinely good. It was my pleasure. Second chances are in short supply these days. That's what this place can be if you let it. Trust me, though. Life within walls is a hell of a lot different than life on the road. Don't take shortcuts like Joan. You gotta do the right thing. Always. Good days, and especially bad. Absolutely. The right thing. No matter what. Good to hear. I read people pretty well. Little gift of mine. You're a capable guy, Javi. Change is in the air here. You can lead that change, and I think you should. For the better. God knows this town could use it. You know what? I'm gonna step up. Lead this place in the right direction. Then as far as I'm concerned, Richmond's in much better hands than it was. Be vigilant. Trouble never stays too far away.
You're alive. Don't remind me. I'm not gonna say thank you for keeping me alive, but I'm gonna try and find something out there that might make me say thank you. Someday. So where's AJ? Tell me. Where? Start saving your soul today. Tell us where AJ is. Don't know how much of that soul I got left. Please. <sighs> what the hell? He's at McCarroll Ranch. It's not too far from here. That's... That's where we left him, at least. Thank you. Good luck out there, Doctor. So you're out of here too, huh? Yeah. It's time. I have to find AJ, Javi. I've waited so long. But could you do me one last favor before I leave? I used to do this for my niece. That's nice of you. She thought I was terrible at it. Were you? Not your business. I have to see AJ Javi. I have to see that he's okay. Do you think he remembers me? At least a little? Who could forget you, Clem? No one who knew you, I guarantee it. Yeah, maybe. Everyone told us he was better off. After everything that's happened, I'm starting to think they're right. I don't know if I was a good mom or not. I can't stop thinking about it. I really wish I could. It's not about good or not good. You kept him alive. You did your job. Until someone else had to do it for me. Gabe told me you used to play baseball. I did. I loved it. He told me you fucked it all up, too. Yep. Sure did. Well, you survived. I had to. But you loved it. How do you survive that? How? If you really loved it, how? You get back out there and find something better. There may not be something better out there. You won't know until you step outside. All done. Well, how's it look? You know what? I'll grab your hat. <laughs> I remember this team. Your dad ever teach you about baseball? No, not really. Well, you come back, and I'll tell you all about it. It's a deal. If I bring AJ back with me, will you teach him too? You bet. He belongs with you, Clementine. Bring him back.
There's never enough light to blind me. Jay. 